It's the showdown at Texas Motor Speedway that follows showdowns at the ballot box. The mayors of Irving and Fort Worth who are here to uh, drag race against each other. The cause that brought them here is a serious one. This is about stopping illegal street racing. More on that in a minute, but we know you're ready to see racing. Both drivers are confident. Oh, we're gonna win. Let's compare them. Fort Worth Mayor Betsy Price is starting her first term. She's a former tax assessor and claims the home field advantage. This is Fort Worth's home turf, so we're gonna win. Irving Mayor Beth Van Dyne is also in her first term. For this former councilwoman, it may come down to experience. Have you had any drag racing experience before? The police are going to be watching this, so I've <laughs> never had any kind of drag racing experience. None you want to admit in public? Yeah, there, thank you very much. From what I have heard, uh, she's not shy. She'll, she'll run someone off the road, from what I understand. That is where I'm going to beat the mayor of Fort Worth on her own track. A trophy and bragging rights are not all that are on the line here. When we win, she's going to furnish Texas Stadium seats out of the old stadium from Irving for all nine council members. And when we win, uh, she's going to provide a, what is it? A, Charlie a Garrett's Railhead dinner. Dinner for all nine of our council members. With the stakes made clear, the drivers get their helmets on and get in position. To make it fair, sponsor Scion provided identical cars. We have a camera inside that will help cover the action for this best two out of three match. You're driving the same car, Shriek. It's all in the driver. All in the driver. Van Dyne is in lane two and Price in lane one. Lane one, are you ready? Lane two, are you ready? One, two. Drivers get back in position because the second heat is getting underway. Fort Worth wins that one, tying it up. Before we get to the deciding race, a closer look at why they are here. They are bringing attention to a summer program here at the Texas Motor Speedway called Friday Night Drags, a weekly event that opens up the track for anyone who has the need for speed. People enjoy doing it. They want to be able to take their cars and rev them up and have someplace safe and, safe and supervised to be able to race them. And this provides them a great opportunity to try to get more kids out here to race their cars or to show and shine to encourage them to come here rather than race illegally in their neighborhoods because that's not safe. And they were also talking about 10% of all of the fatalities and injured drivers come from the state of Texas. So it is a really big problem. That's a big number. So we're jumping on board to try to curtail this. The Speedway converts its pit road into an eighth of a mile drag strip. How exciting is that to be able to race down pit row where the legends of NASCAR and Indy drive? Back at the mayor's race, it is Van Dyne and Price getting that thrill. The pressure is on. Whoever wins this final heat will win the match. One, you ready? Two, you ready? One, two. Yeah. Irving wins it by one. Our uh, Irving Mayor, yes. congratulations. Thank you very much. It was fun. I didn't get the outcome I wanted, but you know, we got to let our guests to the East win. You know, she really was tough competition. You know, most people who know me, you know, I, I, I typically go pretty strong, and you know, I got to give her credit. Their friendly bet is settled. All right, we got y'all dinner. <laughs> they brought attention to their cause. This is a much safer environment. And Irving gets a new trophy. I'm really proud that we get to bring this home to the city of Irving. <laughs>